Okay, um, it's uh, another episode, and um, this is concerning um, the decimal point in the um, number system. So, how do you get to convert decimal points or questions having decimal points in number system? What you just need to do quickly is is very very easy. What you just need to do is first of all, um, all these are in base ten. Yes, they're in base ten. So what you just need to do is uh, the ones before the decimal points. Let me just explain in a way you understand quickly. So I'm going to much talk. The ones before this decimal point are going to be converted the way we did it in the first episode. Do you understand? So that's just how it's going to be. Let me make this an example. Um, then the ones after the decimal point are going to be multiplied by the 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 the, the base you are taking it to this one is to hexadecimal so you multiply it by 16 this one is um octadecimal you multiply it by 8 this one is uh, octadecimal multiply by 8 so this is multiplied by 16 so let's start with this first one so let's look at take a look at the first one uh, the first one which is a uh, five six seven point one eight seven five this thing so quickly first of all you know you change it to base press four then you press four so you change it to base so let's take a look at five six seven first five six seven is in base ten that's decimal then press equals to so you convert it to okay we're taking it to be sixteen right so you take it to hexadecimal hexadecimal shift hexa. so now for this we have in uh, 237 right we have in 237 so 237 this is uh, 237 then the decimal after the decimal we have in 1875 so we have a point 1875 so what we are going to make use of is that we change our capital straight away quickly to mode computer that's mode one so you take it to mode one then once it's in mode one you then make use of um, zero point one eight seven five do you get it now one point eight zero five yes multiply by the base you are taking it to base sixteen okay so we have three point zero so because we have three point zero we put three and subtract this three from this you have zero zero so we we'll stop here so base 16 so that's the answer so let's take a look at the other base 16 we have the example 4 that's 725.25 base 10 to be 16 so let's convert this one first 725 same way we change it to base then seven two five seven two five uh, what is it again what are, what are we doing we press equals to seven two five then shift exam so that's two d five so two d five then point this decimal point is brought down so it's remaining zero point two five right so zero point two five is going to be multiplied by this is going to be multiplied by 16 this will be multiplied this one by 16 we're also going to multiply this one by 16 so let's take a, the multiplication just normal multiplication change your calculator mode then 0 0.25 times 16 so we have 4.0 4.0 so you take the 4 write down the 4 subtract this 4 from this 4 you have 0, 0.0 so we have nothing left so the answer is the, the leftover here is four so that's the answer okay let's take a look at uh, the other one which is example two example two example two is um zero point one eight seven five is ten to base eight that's octadecimal to base eight that's octadecimal so let's quickly do that looking at this octadecimal there is no uh, significant O number here. So what we just do that we will multiply all what we have here 
by 8. So we're having 0. Point, uh, 0. 0.1875 times 8. So we have 1.5. So we're going to write 1. Don't forget this 0 is still coming down. Then this decimal is still coming down. Show you graph. So we're having 1. Then what is left in our calculator? We're having 5 left. If we have 1.5 before, we have 1.5. So we bring the 1 down. There's remaining what? So we subtract this one from this. We're having 0 0.5 left. So you pick this 0 0.5, multiply by this 8. So let's do that. The 0 0.5 multiplied by 8. So we have 4.0 or 4. So 4.0. So we bring this 4 down. And the 4 that we have here, we bring the 4 down. So we have 4. So since we don't have any other thing left, so our answer is 0 0.14 this 8 for this one. So the last one, which is the final one, we have a 4, 9. That's example 3. 49.21875 this 10 to base 8. So same way we're doing this one to 49. Okay, let's first change the mode to this 4. Uh, mode 4 and 49 to mode um, to octadecimal. That's 61. So let's change it. So that's 61. This is 61 point then this now we multiply this by first by it so this is zero point don't forget it is zero point two one eight seven five so zero point two one let's take it to the normal computer mode zero point two one eight seven five multiply by multiply by it so what do we have so we have four. So when you have 7 over 4 like this in your calculator, you press SD, SD to change it to decimal. So what do we have? 1.75. So 1.75, you pick 1. So it's remaining what? 0.75. When you subtract 1 from this 1 that you brought here, subtract from here, it's going to remain 0.75, right? So 0.75, 0.75, yeah. Multiply 0 0.75 by 8. So we have 6. So we bring 6. So what is left? There's nothing. If you subtract 6 from this, you have 0. So the answer for this is 6, 61.16 base 8. So that's just how it's been calculated. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Um, this is still the second episode of the um, number system. Thank you.